And we continue to follow this investigation tonight at 6. I'm Janet Roach. And I'm David Allen. The shooting happened in the 7-Eleven parking lot on Effingham Street in Portsmouth Saturday. 13 News Now reporter Megan Pruyer joins us live with the latest. David, Janet, police held a reset walk today, walking around, talking to neighbors about exactly what happened. But the neighbors who we spoke with said that the community is still very much on edge. Today, police went door to door talking to neighbors in Portsmouth about a shooting that left three people dead. So Wilbur Gore says right now the community has to stick together. All we're going to do is try to keep our eyes open and, and try to stay together and and try to be a watcher for each other. Portsmouth police say a call came in for the shooting around 11 o'clock Saturday night. Christopher Howell says he called police after he saw a man use his car to block another vehicle sitting in a convenience store parking space waiting for two women. He was parked behind their car. He was waiting for them to come out of the store. And when he came out of the store, the heat, they got into their car, and I guess when they realized it was him, the one in the draw passenger side went to get out, and that's when she got shot. Howell says the man then went for the woman in the driver's seat. He walks up, he's standing over the door. He, I don't know if she opened it or he opened it, and all of a sudden he hear like 10 gunshots. But Howell says the shooting continued. And he just walks back to his red car, gets in it, and he stops right in front of the Dollar General sign. I guess he shot himself. Portsmouth police say when they got to the scene, they found three people shot to death. Gore says he just feels for the families involved. I feel sorry for my heart to go out for them because that could be, and I don't know the situation, how it come about, but it could be anyone. Portsmouth police are currently working on identifying those three people shot and contacting their families. Live in Portsmouth, I'm Megan Perrier, 13 News Now.